period. For Chris, a video. Anis, we give a look at your lineup of New Hollands. We can. Uh, I give you just an idea of the range. Yeah. You start with the T4, which starts at 55 horsepower to 75. The T5 then goes from 80 to 140, and there's subdivisions in that different models utility, electric command, dynamic command, and auto command. Then you go from that up to the T6, which starts at 155 to 180, the same range of gearboxes again. Then you run the T7, and up along to the T8, you can keep going, but that's roughly the range of factors. But which should be, we'll just, there's no standing in front of one there, look, the yeah. one thing, even. She has the new 3.6 litre engine, and to go back to where we started, it's the most efficient engine. It's not a 4.5 litre engine because you find from time to time, you know, if it comes on and he goes into place, and he's getting the bigger engine, he's getting the heavier tractor, yes, and he's getting the fuel horsepower more, yes, he thinks he's winning, but really he's not. Yes, go on. We'll say they built that engine for a reason, and we'll go through it in bits. We'll say, if we were pulling a, uh, a plough now, how many horses would we use? Well, I suppose my, my, like my grandfather and all them, they would have had two horses. Yes. They never had four. I suppose they couldn't feed four. No, they didn't need four. No, they didn't, no. And one would be no good. One was a bit slack, two was just right, but three two, was too many. Two was the most efficient. Yeah, yeah. And it's the same with this. Yes, okay. And I'll explain to you why. The torque in, a, in one of those models now uh, can be around 500 newton metres. And if you look at similar tractors and different by different manufacturers, you get the torque, 500, but you look at the horsepower, it's maybe 125. Yes. So that have a little bit more horsepower, maybe a heavier tractor, but the older engine, which wasn't as efficient. So, in this, just to explain what torque is. Torque is the actual turning force off of the back of the engine. And the maximum torque in the engine, whether it is... Massey, John Deere of New Holland is the maximum torque. Right, yes. This engine gives you 500 at 1300 RPM. The other bigger engines have to do 1500 RPM to give you the same. Well, can I, I, I'm, okay, I'm not, I suppose, torque and all this might be above, slightly above my head, but if you're going bigger horsepower and all that, they're burning more diesel. They are, but just to explain torque now, because it, it is, it is, it, it's just a word to some people, and they don't, they're not able to relate it. Yes. Torque is measured in newton meters. Right. Which is, if we get a meter of a rod and add a, a kg of a weight onto it. Yes. That's roughly two newtons. Okay, right, fair enough. And the meter is the limit. That's. That's your balance. That's what, yeah. That's, that's what we're doing. If we can that that uh, kilowatts or horsepower, it's by the RPM of the engine. All so right, okay. That is a form of 9.55 roughly. Yes. To buy by to get it right. But we'll say this engine at 1300 RPM produces its 500 newton meters of torque at about 91 horsepower. All right, okay. The one doing 1500 RPM goes to about 102 horsepower. Yes. So the two tractors are only producing the same off the back of the crankshaft, but one is doing it for 10 horsepower less. We're feeding 10 less horses. An awful lot more efficient. Yes. Roughly more than 10%. Yes. And if a fellow was burning, just for argument's sake, he's burning 4,000 litres of fuel in the year. Yeah. It's not a lot, I can work it out. We'll say he does 200 days work. And we'll say he's burning 40 litres of fuel a day. Yeah. 42 litres of fuel for those days. Yes. Which is not, that wouldn't be... like, it's not a lot. No, so he's not pushing it like. He's 4,000 litres. Yeah. Now, if he's 10% less efficient, that's 600 euro at the minute at 150 a litre. I can feel a nice holiday coming on here. And if we that for 10 years, and yeah. we your wife and who said that, yeah. you have 6,000 euro now there because we saved it because we bought that engine. Yeah. And that tractor. Should be very fun to go. I don't know, Auntie, yeah. But like, your concept of what you were purchasing in, in the start with the bigger, heavier, and le less efficient, was costing you money. In fact, what he was doing when he was giving you all that, every day you told him the key that he, he wanted more money. And I'll just give you a simple thing. I was looking myself, if we look at some cars, they'll do 100 kilometers for about four and a half liters. Yes. 
You look at a Jeep, she could be up in 10 litres of fuel. Yes. You'd have to consider now which one it would sit into yeah. at the moment. Yeah. And that's the yeah. reality of it. Yeah. Now that's only one aspect. Correct. Of where we're at at the minute. Yeah. And what, if I want to get one simple thing across, it's the fella that picks up the phone and he rings, how much? Yeah. It's the yeah. worst thing in the world. You can't explain to him. He doesn't know what he's buying into, what he isn't buying into. But if he just asks one thing, can somebody call out to me if he's too busy? Yeah. Or can I come in and make an appointment to talk to somebody? We don't charge for it. Yes, correct. All he's paying for is the phone call. Yeah. And he can have he can have the information. We'll sit down. We'll go through the different models with him. We'll see which model suits him the best. And he can make that decision. Yeah. And if he thinks maybe down the line he might want a slightly bigger tractor, we can go up to that model and go through that. Then he can have an informed decision what he wants to do and there's one thing we won't be doing here we won't be trying to sell him what we have in the air because that's all we have we have the t4 down that down the air that's okay mm -hmm. the t5 is there there's more in common the t6 is there the t7 is there so we can give him the choice we have the tractor yeah now the reason we have the tractors is they were ordered maybe six eight ten months ago and they will be in we might be a small bit away from some of the models that you know the the, the more popular models move faster yes. and certain models move at different times of the year but all we want to achieve here is if you come in we'll give you all the information you need we'll see which one suits you the best we'll explain why in our own way yeah. and if that's done you can walk out the gate and make an informed decision yourself Yes. you can then talk to New Holland Finance and he'll sit down with you and go through what suits you. And we say if I want to buy a T5 this minute, mm. uh, will you arrange me to meet New Holland Finance? Yes, all I'll do is pick up the phone, ring him and he'll contact you. We've no more to do with it. You, all your financial information is confidential. It's between him and you. So you won't know Haven't to Jack? Clue, don't know nothing. And I don't want to know. No, I don't want to know for because you know the way people are. If you walked out of one house and went to the next house, yeah, it's yeah, way easier yeah, yeah, going yeah, without yeah. carrying any knowledge. We'll say that we shouldn't, and which we wouldn't anyway. But what I'm saying to you is, he'll go through that in an efficient manner. He'll figure out what suits you, what time of the year suits you, what payments you've coming in, what payments you've gone out, and he'll say, look, this time of the year, would you be okay with that? And maybe you're not. You yeah. might have school fees. Or yes. And he'd say, fine, I have them too. And he'll go on, he'll go through something again. And eventually, he'll get to some some level or some ag agreement that will suit you. And that's what it's about. Yeah. Then, when it comes to service, like I said before, there's a service manager, there's a warranty manager inside. Yeah. They look after them. In They'll take all our details, they'll process anything you want. There's the service boys, there's a good group of them there, a great bunch of lads, they look after you. If you go to the stores, you have Tom and John and Claire, they look after you. And if you want to go to the council, you have Marie and Dimpna, they look after you. Yeah. And even at that then, you have myself and Dawn and Mikey on sales, we'll yeah. try and do our best. Yeah. And you have the manager himself, Henry. Yeah. And Henry is, is making his own statement and you can see it. You're on a yeah. No, you don't. It's there in front of you on the main tree of the road. Yeah, that's it. And like, that's what we're about. Yeah. But what we want to do is just, when you're thinking of buying something, Pick up the phone, call in and talk to us. Yeah. We'll do the best we can for you, and you can walk out yeah. with an informed mind as to what you want to buy. And don't be listening to the men up the road. Exactly. Make because up your own the, mind. What I see is you'll get the most expert advice from the fella that never had it. <laughs> yeah, that is All fact. That is fact. And you get some send about something giving you a bit of trouble, and you'll say, Has he had that long? And you'll find out he's never had it. Yeah. But he's after listening to somebody. He means well. Yeah. He's trying to give you his his top and spot. He means awful well. Yeah. But yes, no. It. Just 100%. come and see for yourself. And by all means, if we don't if we, if we don't take it all in today, come back again and get yeah. more of it. And like any aspect you want to know, we're here to help. Come here. I don't know all of it at all. Yeah. I can look up an iPad and see what is. But the one thing I will say, the facts are there. It's yeah. not, you know, I thought or I said. Yes, it's there yes, yes, yes. And yes. if you put the facts, you can, you, can compare, you, can, you can compare one tractor against the other. You can compare the weight. And that's the other thing, you know. If you get a tractor that's too heavy, mm -hmm. you can't throw off the weight. If I no. want to cycle up, 
the hill across the way there, I'm a bit of a problem. Yes, with that. That yes. Too much weight. Yeah. Power to weight is wrong. But if the fella knows that it was lighter and happier, he'll go faster. He's more efficient at that job. Same with this. Yeah. If we need a bit of weight, because wheel weights that fit in there, you wouldn't even see them. Yeah. And now, they may not be necessary, but if they are, you can fit them. Yeah. So oh. that's one thing you can do if, that, if she's over. You can't can, take, can, can take it you off. You can't take it off, no. And like we get them in load already. All you yes, do is I've decide that, what yeah. load of frame you want, whether you yeah. want self leveling, whether you want to go high lift or anything. We have yeah. the load of frames there to, to suit. So that's basically it. Oh, in and talk. We said the T5 there now, as we're just looking at. But you know, that one's not there, it's sold, it's gone. We mm. say frag, we say. No, that one is actually for sale. Oh, is it very it's good? It. And good. That's, that's another one there, look. Oh, brilliant. But we say if I wanted a T5 now of something maybe slightly different or. Yeah. Uh, whatever. What am I looking at lead time? Uh, there's 90s. There's uh, 90s should be in in about maybe I could drive in the yard in a minute, but in, within a week. Yeah. The one tins are there. There's another one in Clare. There's two 120s in Clare at a minute. Brilliant. Um, there's 120 dynamics and 140s coming. There's 160s coming. There's 180s there. There's a T7 there, and there's another couple of T7s coming. They'll be in shortly. Yeah. So we have a good mix of stuff, and you're not waiting that long. Now, to be fair, the longer you're waiting, the longer we're waiting to get the training off. Yes, you. yes, yes. The more tire wear, and unfortunately, the quicker we can do the deals, the better. So that's why, again, it's back yeah. to the men in charge. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're lucky that way. Yes, you know, the, the setting absolutely. is not the hardest part. It's just being able to deliver and finish it off. Load it up, deliver it, that's what we're about. What do they call it? Future buying or future purchasing? Yeah, well, we, we yeah. Have, that's part of it. You have to, you have to plan. Yeah. You have to plan your, your stock orders maybe 12 months in advance, but that's always been the case. Even oh, it then, has, right, even yes. When stuff is, is readily available, you still have to plan 12 months ahead, figure out what yeah. volumes you'll be selling at the different models, you have to order the loaders ahead. You know, this, yeah, but that's part of it. It's like the for the milk and the cows, you know, it's putting the silage to feed it for the yeah. winter. But like, you, you have, look, I know we're here where Buckley's uh, in Listowel or whatever, but you, you, you really have everything here. You really have the full, it's a full stop shop, like. Well, we ho we try to be as efficient as we can to give the best, you know, to give the best spread of product that we can. Yeah. And like, if you want tractor inside the yard, so you can walk around it and it means nothing other yes, than what you're looking at but you can't compare it to the one next to it yes and you can't compare it to the one next to that and like you need to be able to do that and then you have to decide is he going to be pulling a dribble bar on a 2000 gallon tank yeah. is his land high yeah is yeah. his land extremely high and you have to go on slightly heavier way to do a couple yeah. of that yeah and you can say to him look throw down the devil a 120 my dude yeah if you're up and ground you i'd be thinking maybe a 180 is what you'd need yes. to go or He'd say, you know, in a wet day, well, then we might want to go up in a T7165 yes. or whatever. You know, that's yeah. that's what coming in means. Yeah, it could, it, and like I said, picking up the phone and how much is the very same. You know what? You'd have a better chance of winning the lottery yeah. than getting an answer. Yeah, yeah. From yeah, any dealer. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. You know? And it's like we said when we started about the, the fellow with the horses. He put two horses pulling the floor because they were the most efficient. Yeah. And like eventually he decided... They weren't the most efficient. Yes. He went on to a tractor because he could pull two for us. Correct. Instead of the two boys. Yeah. Then he put three on it. But he was still working with the most efficient. Yeah, yeah. It hasn't yeah. changed. No, it hasn't. And that's why they could have left a four and a half litre engine in that tractor. They had it in it. Yeah. But it wasn't the most efficient. Yeah. So up to 120 horsepower, you have to go on the slightly smaller engine because we've gone to tier five. Tier 5 runs a little hotter. Mm -hmm. The bigger engine runs a little, you know, she, she take longer to heat it Yes, up. correct. So that's why they went to that. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, like, yeah, yeah. It's, just, it's, 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 a, it's what we have. It's a tool in the box for selling. And it saves you money. So Yeah. Why would that's we, what it's why about. Would we promote it? That's what it's about. You know, it's correct. about saving money. It's about, it's about, look, the reality is it's what you can have in your pocket correct. at the end of the day. Yeah. And we don't want to be giving it to the big diesel companies. And, All right. Yeah. Yes. That's it. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. that's our tractor thing. Call in and talk to us. Call in and talk to us. And we'll talk about gearboxes and we could go from, you could say, the, uh, you know, the direct drive box. Yeah. Sim the simplest box in the world. Yeah. Because the newest technology, but it's the simplest thing in the world. Yeah. With two shafts, with all the odd gears in one shaft. Yes. 
one, three, five, and seven. Right. On the other shaft, you have two, four, six, and eight. And all she does is squeeze that shaft, squeeze that shaft with two. Oh, yeah. Shafts. And this is the beauty of it. Go on. Think of a door hanging in a jam. Yes. And if we close it here, it closes to that side. Yeah. And if we close it here, it closes to that side. Yes. You can't close the two together. No. So yes. You can't lock. It can't shaft. lock. No, it can't. And you won't be drinking out through the windscreen. Yeah. So it's yeah. just feeding that shaft, just feeding him, it's just feeding this shaft. And all it's doing is catching one, letting go, catching and just changing away the same as if, yeah. if, if you had no drive from the engine. So you've a mechanical box with no loss of power. Brilliant. That's what a dynamic command is. All oh, right, okay. That's what that box is. But like again, if you come in, we we'll go through all those different yeah. vehicles. Yeah. They're all features. There's auto commands, slightly different, slightly not as efficient, but has has a benefit for certain work. But we have the options of standard, 12 by 12, or we've got like they had 50 years ago. Mm -hmm. We've the power shuttle box. Mm -hmm. We've the power shuttle with the hind low. Yes. We've the power shuttle with electric command, which is the four, the four speeds power shift. Yes. We've the auto command, which is a infinitely variable box. And we've the dynamic command, which is a, what they call dual clutch technology now. Or yeah, and command. look, if, no matter who comes in, there's, a, there is there's something, something there for There them. is, but like you have to apply the proper product. Yeah. To the proper individual correct to give correct. him the best value for money yeah there is no point if he's only coming home after work and feeding a few cattle all he wants to do is stop this tractor we have that tractor yeah if he wants to do topping with an eco pto we have that tractor yeah if he wants to do gps spreading we have the we can mount the the screen inside it put up the gps and the roof on it and for reasonable money we have that track. Yeah. It yeah. Just didn't go on to break the bank. And just see, look, the reality is, uh, dynamic, dynamic, whatever you call it, boxes and all yeah. that, they mean nothing to 90% of people, but when they come in here, They'll you, find out. you can find out. Yes. And they, when, they, when they go home, they still don't need to know what it means. No. It but if bother. it's something that will suit them, and if it works for them. Basically, all you have to know with the, with the dynamic box is you have 24 forward gears, yeah. and the last gear is an eco gear on the road, and she's cutting back in fuel, more fuel saving again. Taking over. Yeah. She, yeah. she, she wouldn't be taking over, but again, yeah. when the torque is, is between 13 and 1500, when she comes down to that, you have maximum power at that. And the other thing is, on the, a lot of these engines, they have a flat, what they call a flat power pump. When they hit 1900 RPM, she's full power. All so right, okay. 2000 or 2100 or 2200. Yes. You still have the same horsepower. Brilliant. And if we look at other models, you'll see the, the power curve going down. Yes. She's losing horsepower, even if, you know. Yeah. And like, the men would say, oh, but you sure if we have the horsepower. And it's as simple as this. You'll go down a hill in the bike with me up on it. Does it be the weight on the hill? Yeah, the yeah. She'll go so far up the hill. Yes. No, probably faster than the light fella. Yeah. That's that from them. But then what will I do? Yes. I want a lot of gears to carry up the rest of the way. You want a lot of chocolates to get to the... <laughs> be taken right. I would have headed for that. That's yeah. really where we're going. So that's yeah. it. Come in and talk. Anus, and uh, where are you? Like here, I suppose. Look, I know where you are. You're, yeah. you're a mile out on to the stall and uh, the stall to the road. Uh, but on the right hand side, if we're going towards to the, you'll see the big No Holland sign. Have a look in. It is impressive. Nice it is, yard. yeah. Uh, good service facilities and good stores facilities. And as like we that. can see there, the, look, you have all the you have all the parts and you have the mechanics and you have the vans and yeah. everything well, is there. It's a one stop shop. <laughs> You can't have one without the other because no. it, it is like everything. It's a team. And it's a team, effort, the team yeah. It, if you haven't the team, you're at nothing. And you must have all the team. Yeah. So it's like having 14 minutes on, on next Sunday. When we go yes, to correct. Back, we'd be off alone so we'd know about Yeah, it. yeah, yeah. And like, of course, what's down the yard as well is you have a good selection of second-hand tractors yeah. as well, like. A good range of second-hands and they're gone through. Some of them, it'll be... But they're checked over, they're brought up to the front, and they carry they carry warranty. So there's a level of comfort. Again, there's the No Holland Finance look after the second hands in the finance packages. So they are there as well. Yeah. And uh, most of the second hands we have are our own that we sold new. No, so we only bring it back our own. You so know the history we, of the tractor and everything. Yeah. The anyway. And again, the other side of it is only simple thing. The fella trading back that tractor was happy with us. Yes. And we were happy with him. So. There's a good chance the tractor was out in the other half. Yeah, yeah, you know? yeah, 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 yeah. That's, yeah. that's really it. I thought that's a good judge of a garage, actually, don't when you'd come back in and you'd see, and I walked around there a while ago, and there's a good few second-hand tractors there, and they all have Buckley stickers up on them. Got the it. older Buckley stickers. Yes. 
correct. Do you know, so they're happy that customers true. that are coming that back. That is true. Well, like if it happened, if you need a customer base to run anything, no matter what it is. Yeah. And if you have the falling, you can give the service. And if you have the service, you'll have the falling. It, they're all interlocked. And it's not, like I said, it's not one person. We can sell it, go through, give you the best information we can. But so much. Must be followed with the service. Yes. And he must bond with who is well in, in his own way. Yeah. And then when you ring up for a few pieces, you bond with him in your own way. And then if there's a few pound owed, when that person rings you, you have to bond with him. And in general, it's just yeah. it's like a family. It's like one big happy family. Well, it might be always happy, but <laughs> yeah. it's, definitely, it's, it's, it's definitely interlocked. Brilliant. Brilliant. And interwoven with each other. Yes, thank you. That's it. So, and thanks to all the lads here. What I'll do, look down the bottom of the, the video there, if you click on it, there'll be a description and I'll put in a link to Buckley's. Perfect. And if anyone wants the phone number, it'll be there as well. And just Perfect. contact them. They're there. What? Period. Well, great. Here's a video.